Hello, my crafty friends. You're watching Cards TV. This is Mary, and I want to welcome you to the Teddy Bear Parade Blog Hop. This is going to be so much fun, guys. Everybody's just crazy about this Teddy Bear Parade cartridge. So, several people got together and decided to do a blog hop. And so many people wanted to be in it that it's now going to be three days. So each day you'll see different designers using different teddy bears out of this cartridge. And they're going to be cards and uh, scrapbook layouts and craft projects. So you don't want to miss anybody, guys. And there's blog candy, too. So I'm going to have each day listed on my blog. All you have to do is look below this video and you'll have each participant listed so you'll know where to go and you won't get lost. Now, like I said, several ladies are given blog candy and so am I. All you have to do is be a follower of Cards TV and leave me a comment and you'll be entered to win two sets of Cards TV stamps. And I'll use random.org to pick a winner, and I'll announce the winner uh, next Tuesday. I believe that's it. November 6th. That's right. Now, I want to show you what I made today. Of course, I used the Teddy Bear Parade cartridge. I also used Joys of the Season. The papers are from this adorable paper pad called Mary. And this is from uh, My Mind's Eye. And there's just the cutest papers in here and they're double sided and it was hard for me to choose which one I wanted to use because they're all so stinking cute also for our sentiment we'll be using one of my cards TV stamp sets this one's called Holly Jolly and we'll be using have a Holly Jolly Christmas so let me show you my little bear and what we're gonna do with him now on this cartridge several of us have decided just to go ahead and cut out a whole sheet of bears and put them together and then they're ready to be dressed and they're just cute as can be just like this but there's all these adorable little outfits in here for all the different occasions and holidays and seasons and because it's November and getting close to Christmas I decided to use the Santa bear right down here let me show you what I did to him I think he turned out so cute. I wanted him to be all sparkly and shiny. So I've used a lot of die cuts with a view glitter paper on him. Can you see all that sparkle? He's a very sparkly little Santa bear. And I cut him out at three inches. So I cut my little bear out at three inches, put him all together. And right here, the very first uh, column and the first cut. You'll find out how to put your bear together. And Santa is on the very last page, and he's the third cut up from the bottom. And I cut all the pieces that go to him. His red suit, his white fur, his black belt, his buckle. And there's also a little gift. Here it is. Cut all that at three inches and put him together. Now the card is going to be an s fold card. So I've got some craft paper right here this is an s fold or a z fold you can call it either one but this is four and a quarter by five and a half and to go on this front flap i've cut a red mat and this red mat is two inches by five and three eighths and then from that adorable little paper pad i've cut this red and uh, craft colored snowflake paper and this is one and seven eighths by five and a quarter I'm going to layer these together and then put them on the front of my card. I'll just grab my ATG gun for that. Now, for the inside of the card, I've cut another piece of the red, and all the cardstock is from Basil. It's nice, heavy cardstock. And this is 4 inches by 5 and 3 eighths inches. And then I cut another cute little piece of paper from that uh, Christmas stack, and this is 3 and 3 quarters by 5 and a quarter. I'm going to put these together with my ATG gun and get those on the inside. Look at these cute little snowmen on the back. I'll be using that one day too. Now our card base is all ready and I'm going to go ahead and put my sentiment on the inside. And I took some ivory cardstock and I took the sentiment from the Holly Jolly 
Cards TV stamp set and went ahead and stamped it in uh, Memento Tuxedo Black ink. And this ivory card stock is two inches by three and a half. And I have another piece of the red to use to go behind it. And this red is two and a quarter by three and three quarters. I'm going to layer these together get them adhered and I'm going to put these I'm going to center them up and down but I'm going to move it over just a little bit because it's got to be hidden by our little bear that's going on the front so I'm going to add that about a half an inch from this side so I'll get these together and we'll have the inside of our card done. Now we've got our sentiment inside and you still have plenty of room to write your name and any other sentiment you'd like to on the inside. Now we need something to put our little Santa bear on. So I've cut out a tag from the Joys of the Season cartridge and it's going to go on the front just about like that. And you'll find this tag on page 80 and here it is right here. I cut the striped part of the tag at four and a quarter inches. And that's the striped paper. And then I cut the shadow out of red. I've layered them together and I just ran some ribbon through the top. I'm going to adhere this, but I'm only going to put adhesive on this part of the tag right there. I'll have to get that lined up just right. And then we're going to add our little bear. And he's going to go right there. It's going to be really cute. And then, of course, we've got some buttons we're going to add and a little, the little present that goes with our bear. So let me get some adhesive on here and get this added. And we'll come back and take a look at the finished card. Here's my little Teddy Bear Parade Santa s fold card. I think he turned out really, really cute. Now, I've got him and the little gift on two thicknesses of foam tape. And I added the little black buttons with some glue dots. And there's the inside. Have a holly jolly Christmas. I think it turned out really cute. Now, guys, don't forget to leave me a comment to get entered for the blog candy. That's two sets of Cards TV stamps. And you should have started the hop with Janice. So if you didn't, just look below this video on my blog and you'll find the whole list of everybody that's participating today, tomorrow, and the next day. Don't miss anybody, guys. This is really, really going to be so much fun. So make sure you go and visit everybody and leave them some comment love. We all love that, don't we? Thank you so much for coming by and hopping with us today. I'll see you again soon. Bye now.